get the guys out of prison. Oh, look at y'all. You're in prison. Are y'all ready to run free? Hi. Hey, everybody. How you doing? I saw your reflection. I thought somebody in the truck beside you waved at us while you waved at the camera, but it's, it's like you're weird. You'll see it in the video. It's a weird reflection. It looks just like a person. Never mind. You'll see it. Okay, never mind. <laughs> we just delivered over at SeaTech Airport. And now we got to go get another load. Do you want to hear the fun story about that one? If y'all have ever been in airports and security, you got to open your doors and open your boxes and everything, and they look in there, right? This woman... What? I'm talking... Uh, no, you're, you're good. This woman decided that if we had any bags, she needed to look in them. What? If I have a purse or a backpack or a lunchbox, she needs to see inside of it. I said, no, I just don't have any bags. We live in a truck. She didn't want to see Everything's in a container, right? She didn't want to see in your drawers. I, I guess if she wanted to, I could have told her she could get up in here and whatever she got out to put back and clean up along the way. She was just odd. She was trying to do her job. She wasn't doing a very good job. She didn't She's just really snooping want to do in my job. purse. She just, she just wanted to act like she was doing her job. She didn't look in the side didn't boxes. Look in the side boxes at all. But she looked in my purse. She's just nosy. Want to see what's going on in my purse? That's all she would have found. Oh my god! Put him down. You don't go in talking about my lady flu. I swear I'm going to kill you. <laughs> he makes announcements about it everywhere. I, I'm not exactly sure why. Come on, let's go pick up our load. We'll talk to them later. We'll see you in a little bit, guys. All right, we just got loaded up and got out of there. This is our load today. It's some leap stands. Charles, you know all about these, don't you? Anyway, you know they're heavy and they don't, they don't pay great. Hey, they still pay better than general rate. Whatever, right? I ain't gonna cry about it. What are you doing, girl? Hey, I need to take pictures. I gotta take pictures. All right, take your That's pictures. $5 all right. So what you gonna have for dinner, little girl? A big fat ribeye. Veggies, I suppose. Zucchini, squash, and cauliflower medley? Is that what she said? Or carrot or something? I don't know. Some vegetables. Vegetable medley. Vegetables medley. Where are we going? Where are we going? We got a double biller again. So, how come you're not sitting over here by me so you can get recorded? Oh, come I here. Can do that. So, we are going. We picked up. Uh, Clinton, those empty racks, and then we're gonna go pick up a box of I don't even know what. It's a five by five by five box in Oregon and taking it to California. Is it a crash card or something? I don't know. Something like that. It's a box. It's going to LAX. Sort of. And taking it to Southern California. Oh, they, they have then we're going to North Carolina. Maybe they'll find something else on the way again to put up there. I doubt it. We're pretty like, loaded. Um, there's a lot of miles in there. between here and there. A 34 or even a 56 to go up there. Yeah. Ooh, 56 might be too heavy. We would. Maybe. We were gonna stop by and see Karen Price, and by golly, this we was we was going North Carolina, right? And then this load, got, since they added this on, we gotta go to LA, then North Carolina. So we'll be running along I twenty in better weather. I will add. Yeah. Hey, we won't get snowed out and have to stop. It is what it is. Sorry, Karen. We really wanted to come over and see you. I'm sure we'll be back up here again. Yeah. Mark, we're going to leave a rock here. Did you tell them where we were? No, I don't know. We're in Olympia. Olympia. The ribeye. Ribeye Ramblin' Jack. Right, right. Thank you. 
This is the rock we're gonna leave today. What's it say? It says give thanks. Oh. Oh. All right. That's the rock. All right. We're gonna we're gonna leave it here somewhere, and we're gonna steal one of their rocks while we're here. Actually, we're gonna steal two or three of their rocks. We're gonna leave one though. We're gonna. And we'll leave them elsewhere. We're rock litterers. Yeah. But this ought to be pretty good. We can't pick up till in the morning. So that means that Thursday morning, we'll kick it off down there and get the hell out of LA. We don't want to hang around there. But that means that you're going to, the next morning, we're going to be getting some chorizo and eggs at the Petro and in your Ontario. Place. That's right, because I love their chorizo and, and eggs. I don't know why. Chorizo's a thing. It is. In eggs. Yeah. As long as I, and I know I shouldn't have no beans with a diet, but you know what? I'm going to have some beans. That's just Sometimes so he cheats. He cheats more than me and he still loses more than me. Which I also think is BS, but what am I going to do about it? You don't have man muscles. You know, I don't have any muscles. You're kind of squishy and soft. I like that. I am kind of squishy and soft. God, I'm glad her name's not Bruno. That would be terrible. Then I'd be in prison. Lola? No, because we got lost on land and her name was Lola. Oh, isn't that what that song was? Somebody yes, told me that one what, day. Yes, that's what the song is all about. Yes. But it's not. I never even realized it until someone told me. It's not 1968. It'd be alright. <laughs> alright, we gotta eat this food, alright? We'll talk to y'all later.